Good morning. My name is Jordi Esteve, and I am a hematologist at Hospital Clinic of Barcelona. Targeted agents refer to small molecules or antibodies directed against a mechanism of survival and, and proliferation characteristic of the leukemic cells and not present or less expressed in normal cells. With this direct agent uh, action, uh, the aim is to, to get a higher anti-leukemic efficacy with a lower toxicity. Several targeted agents have already evidenced a benefit, a clinical benefit for AML patients. Thus, fleet three inhibitors are uh, used in clinical practice, and two of these agents have provided, in addition to intensive chemotherapy, have resulted in a improved survival in patients harboring this frequent mutation. In addition, free inhibitors are useful in relapsed disease or uh, as maintenance after allogenic stem cell transplantation. On the other hand, an ith one inhibitor, ifosidenib, in combination with azacitidine, has uh, shown very recently a marked effect, anti-leukemic effect, in patients non-eligible for intensive chemotherapy. Moreover, penetoclax, an oral agent uh, which are BCL2 inhibition uh, mechanism of action, is the cornerstone of the AML treatment in patients non-candidates for intensive chemotherapy. And beyond that, new uh, novel indications of treatment uh, multiple uh, new combinations of these agents and also uh, new targets, molecular targets, are being explored in clinical trials. And all this research is ultimate uh, or has the ultimate objective to cover, to address those unmet needs uh, in the field. This is the case, for example, of patients with very high risk genetic subtypes such as patients with uh, TP53 mutations, or uh, to prolong, to enlarge the, the, the efficacy provided by low intensity regimens in patients, uh, non-candidates for intensive chemotherapy. Thank you very much.